And now, it's time for the Roadshow Feedback Booth. This is my spectrochrome therapy machine. By sliding the different glass colored sheets, you can cure whatever ails you. And this little piece I was gonna leave home for my collection because I thought it wasn't worth anything and it was actually worth the most at $1,500. This, less than the price of my suit, but at least we get to check off Antiques Roadshow from our bucket list. This is my opium pipe that I inherited from our dad and evidently everybody inherited one of these from their dad. So I'll just have fun with my opium pipe. And I brought my 1939 World's Fair memorabilia. And um, thanks for Antiques Roadshow again for a good time. This is my fourth time and mom and dad, I'm still broke. We brought my mother's violin from the 30s. We found out it was built you know, or made in about the uh, turn of the century. It's worth about $2,000. So this might cover a little bit of Mary Lou's tuition this fall. We found out that one man's junk sometimes is just one man's junk. This is Sleepy Eye Pottery, and we found out that they used to give it away free in flour. And we really hope this episode of Antiques Retro doesn't air until after December 3rd, because we got engaged, but we're eloping. <laughs> I'm Mark Wahlberg. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on Antiques Roadshow. Dinah know what's in the box. What you got? I've got oh. an antique doll. Oh, she's beautiful. And now, it's time for the Roadshow Feedback Booth. And I brought my mother's cheesecake plate with the mouse on it that she left for me. And I found out it's not as valuable as I thought it would be. But it was nice to be here, and I love Antiques Roach. And we found out everything, including myself, is worth 250 to $300 today. <laughs> we had a lot of fun at the Roadshow and found out that this Pinocchio picture is worth $400 to $600. So I'll be able to get myself about one textbook for college. <laughs> this is my husband's grandfather's Tibetan statue. Thousand bucks. Thanks, Roadshow. We brought my grandpa's planter's peanut jar um, that he had in his bar and we thought it was just cool and worth a little money and the appraiser said, well, it's not worth a whole lot, about $150, but she felt bad for us, so this is what she did for us. In her lunch bag, she had a little bag of peanuts that she gave us so we wouldn't feel so bad. So thank you, Kathleen, our appraiser. <laughs> And we found out that my Abraham Lincoln signed document is authenticated and its insurance value of $10,000. Yay! And my unicorn vase was not as special, but uh, worth $20. Yay. Thank you, Antiques Roadshow. Thanks. I'm Mark Wahlberg. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on Antiques Roadshow. You been waiting long? Can I look at the basket? What do you know about it? This one is a Yupik Tundra grass basket. This was made in... And now, it's time for the Roadshow Feedback Booth. My hand tools, Native American hand tools I found, and my landscape rock are worth about $50. People were more interested in the beer box that I was hauling them around in. Should have brought more beer. I got this furniture 23 years ago. He had to carry it through the entire Roadshow. He's only 16. <laughs> oh, no. No, I don't want that one. You know? I, the way you... Wait, are we... Is this going to be on? Yeah. And I have my Willie Mays sunglasses. And they're from 1955. And Willie Mays is my hero. And they're worth 100 bucks. And Willie is still my hero. They tell me it's 106 degrees outdoors today right now in Rapid City. I'm inside in my raccoon coat that belonged to my mother-in-law. And I'm comfortable in it right now. <laughs> and I brought my um, grandfather's father's uh, World War I paperweight. It's worth $25, so it was fun. <laughs> and we brought these great lamps from my mother-in-law, and the lamps weren't worth a lot of money, but we think the shades will still be good, good for the next party. party we're at. We brought our 1948 autographed copy of John Melock's record. Nobody has ever heard of John here, unfortunately. So John, if you're still by any chance out there and you're watching, call me. I've got the only copy of your record left. Thanks, Antiques Roadshow. I'm Mark Wahlberg. Thanks for watching. See you next time on Antiques Roadshow. Hey, you guys, thanks for volunteering. 
Did you have a good day? Now you're going to get your appraisal done? Can I peek? Sure. Oh, look at that collection.